It is currently June 13th, 2022, and despite Twitter making Nintendo Direct trend every day, there is still no official announcement from Nintendo announcing a Direct. And what's weird to me personally in this situation is that it's basically E3 season. Sony had their state of play earlier this month, and I think Microsoft had some showcase thing like one or two days ago. I don't know, I don't follow Microsoft, I have a PC, no need for an Xbox Series X, get that shit out of here. And Nintendo is just nowhere to be seen this month, they're just missing an action or diddling off in the corner, like, come on man, get your ass on the big screen already, we're halfway through June, at least now something for July, just something. And yes, we know Nintendo disappears sometimes and doesn't do a Nintendo Direct for about a year and a half. No, I haven't forgotten Nintendo, and I won't. But what I'm trying to say is that it feels like Nintendo had nothing planned for this month. Like, they knew E3 was cancelled, so they didn't have to meet a deadline for a Nintendo Direct. So now they're just taking their sweet ass time making one. Which may be for the best. But it's still one of the best times of the year to announce new games, or at least give us updates on new games, and maybe even announce a new console. The Switch is 5 years old, Nintendo. But now recently, there's been a rumor going around, saying that there will be a Nintendo Direct this month, on the 29th and they just haven't announced it yet, and you may be asking, what's the proof? Well, the strongest piece of proof, if you can even call it that, of there being a Nintendo Direct on June 29th is a clip of Alana Pierce saying so. 29th, yeah, June 29th, Nintendo Direct. Um, it's not technically a leak because Nintendo didn't tell me, which is how I make that call, but it's also, I'm not leaking anything that's in it, which is what I think is shitty. Now, I'm not gonna outright say she's lying, but personally, I don't believe her. And yes, I know Alana is a pretty trustworthy source, but she has no proof for her claims that there will be a Nintendo Direct on June 29th. The only proof we have from her is to just believe her, which for me and many other people is not enough. I want that solid, hard proof. Now, maybe she's right. Maybe she does have information from insiders that we don't. But according to Nintendo themselves, there will be a shareholders meeting on June 29th. Don't you think that's a pretty bad time to have a Nintendo Direct? So now I think it's sure to say that there won't be a Nintendo Direct on June 29th. I'm sure there'll be one soon, we just don't know exactly when. And the best thing to do at the moment is just wait and see if there's a Direct this month and do the smart thing, which is not follow rumors and wait for official updates from Nintendo themselves because 99% of rumors are false. But what if I told you there will be a Nintendo Direct on July 4th. That's right, my friend that works at Nintendo has given me an exclusive insider look at the next Nintendo Direct, which will be happening on July 4th, 2022 at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And unlike Alana Pierce, I have solid proof. Take a look. I know, the photos are a bit low quality, but look, solid proof, shit you've never seen before, like schedules, dates, upcoming releases of new games to be announced, like Super Smash Bros. Ultra, that shit's coming out in 2023, that's not far at all. So in conclusion, save the date, July 4th, 2022, a brand new Nintendo Direct announcing some crazy titles for the coming years. So, if you like this video, subscribe, like the video, share it with a friend, or share it in a Discord server, put it on Twitter, any social media you'd like to, and that's it, comment what you'd like to see in the next upcoming Nintendo Direct.